so how it work is suppose if i select here the month as october so you can see based on my selection it's showing the data and if i expand this to november and december and jan also so you can see based on our selection we are getting the data hi everyone welcome to excel dose in today's video i will show you that how to create a timeline slicer in excel so let's get started with the video so as you can see i have a some raw data here which i have a project name owner due date as well as the status so first thing is what you have to do is simply the control a means we have to select the complete data and then click on insert and then we have to create a pivot table and then i will use the existing worksheet here so i will select this particular cell and then click on okay the moment you click on okay so you can see here we are getting the pivot table field so we have to select all these uh, fields and then we have to make sure it's coming in the row section and then we have to click on design part and here we have to click on subtotals and we have to click on do not show subtotals and the next grand totals of for rows and columns and for report layout we have to select the show in a tabular form and now you can see we are getting the all the data in the pivot table and next what we have to do is we have to select control a or uh, select complete data and then click on analyze and here we have to click on insert timeline so it will automatically select the due date and then simply tick mark this one and then click on ok and now you can see we are getting here our timeline and if you want to change the color you can change it from here or you can select from here also like dark one like how i have selected and now you can simply use it and if i select here the month as november or let's say for the previous month so i will select here the october right so and december also i will select so now you can see we are getting the result based on our selection so if you want to change the height and the width you can change it from here so this is how you can create timeline slicer in excel i hope you like this video please like share and subscribe to excel dose thank you so much for watching